Let's talk about catmint. Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to the Shades of Green Show. Today's episode is a plant profile about Walker's Low Catmint, Nepeta ficinii. This is a beautiful, easy to grow, low maintenance herbaceous perennial, meaning it will die back in a typical North Texas winter and return each spring. It averages 18 to 24 inches tall and wide. This one's been in the ground for a few years and is 18 inches tall and almost three feet across. Now, you want to plant catmint in full to part sun. Like most plants, it prefers well-drained soil, which can be tricky in the heavy black clay of Collin County. However, Walker's Low is very forgiving and can thrive in a variety of soil and sunlight conditions. That said, it prefers spots that are sunny and dry. Here at Shades of Green, we have it planted on the south side of the building, where it receives plenty of sunlight and not much water. But don't think you can forget about watering altogether. For an abundant bloom, you'll want to water regularly, at least weekly, and a bit more often in extreme heat or when it's planted in containers. You'll know when catmint is happy, as it provides an abundance of beautiful blue-purple flower spikes from mid-spring through fall. As you can see, this is a very showy plant. It's an excellent addition to any pollinator garden, attracting bees, butterflies, and hummingbirds all season long. As for cats, the true cat nip, the one that drives most cats crazy, is Nepeta cataria. Now, some cats do take an interest in Walker's Low, Nepeta ficinii, but we have three nursery cats here at Shades of Green, and they aren't particularly interested in it. Walker's Low was introduced in Europe in the late 1980s and quickly gained in popularity. In 2007, it was named Perennial Plant of the Year by the Perennial Plant Association. It's been a staple of our perennial selection for years because it just works. It blooms a long time, looks great, isn't that fussy, and it can really fill a space. Now, the name Walker's Low purportedly refers to a place in England and not the plant size because it can get two feet tall and three feet wide. All around, Walker's Low Catmint is an excellent perennial for almost any garden. I'm Tim with Shades of Green Nursery and Landscape. Thanks for watching the Shades of Green Show. Mm -hmm.